Hey guys, what is up? It's Dusty here and welcome back to another episode of the Daily Crypto News. And guys, today I have for you guys an update on Shiba Inu as a couple of very big things have happened. And honestly, even though it's not my biggest holding or my favorite crypto, I think it's a crypto with a lot of potentials for mostly the reasons that I'll describe in this video. Let me give a couple of quick little rundowns though. Shiba Inu is a meme coin, a coin that was designed for the jokes with no real intention behind it except for being a joke, very much like Dogecoin. It performed exceedingly well, just crazy well over the last bull run. And it's actually one of the only meme coins that really stayed relatively high in the market cap. I'm not sure what exact place it is, but I'm estimating somewhere around 20. With that in mind, people like Elon Musk were really hyping up these meme coins at the time, like Dogecoin, and for that reason, also things akin. And people were hoping that the coin was going to go to one cent, but mostly based upon just this idea that it was going to magically get there without any fundamentals, just buying on top of buying. Now, there were a couple of measures put in place, though, over time. One of the major things was a very big burn and... At the end of the bull run, maybe even after the bull run had ended, is this new initiative for a metaverse slash game. Now, again, Shiba Inu is not unique in creating a game at all. But as I said before, crypto gaming is, is a relatively new realm, right? You guys all understand. And right now, if I had to ask you, what is the most popular crypto game for non-crypto people? I, I don't really think you'd be able to pick something. There's not really that many games that are popular for everyday non-crypto people. But even if you're only talking about crypto people, what's the most popular game? And for that reason, based on that alone, I'm thinking honestly, there's very, very big potential behind Shiba Inu. Oh, I'm trying to move away my uh, screen. So one thing we have to take a look at is this right here. Shiba Inu's new game, right? We talked about it before. It was launching at some point. October 1st, 2021, the announcement came in. So basically throughout the bull run, but a little bit towards the end. Oh. And basically right now there was a new announcement that two things are going to happen. One, well, you can actually read it for yourself. Shiba Inu new game in its $15.7 billion market with 5% revenue burn for Sheep token. The Sheep team announces that October 1st is going to be the download date for the Shiba Eternity game. Now, what is the game going to be about? We'll talk about it in just a second. Just know that finally they put a stamp on the exact date. And so this is something to look forward to as a Shiba Inu holder because they have a lot of potential to become the number one in this specific realm, I think, in the crypto gaming realm. Or potentially, oh, wait a minute. What's going on? Uh, ah, okay, I cannot pause the video anymore. So I'm going to try just do this in one recording. There's a little problem with the pausing button. I'm not exactly sure what is happening, but hey, that's life sometimes. I'll just try to edit the video later. It's going to be fine. All right, so Shitoshi Kusama revealed that 5% of the Shiba Eternity revenue would be for burning sheep tokens. This is obviously a very big deal. 5% of all the revenue towards burning? I mean, Shiba Inu is already one of the coins that does a lot of burning. And actually, looking at some of the articles which I've read, it might be that Shiba Inu is actually the the the, the OG coin for, for, for getting things burned. I think the article is over here. Uh, Shiba Inu adds over 35,000 holders. Uh, I think it might be. No, there's actually a lot of cool things about Shiba Inu I'm noticing now. Damn. But yeah, this is the, the right one. Former U.S. congressional candidate says Shiba Inu started the entire burn craze. And honestly, I, I don't think that's too crazy to assume or accept that Shiba Inu was the coin that launched this entire, let's burn a lot of it. Let's go for a crazy high supply and just keep burning it so it becomes more scarce and scarce. So there's more demand over time, basically, while it still looks as if you're holding a lot by this just high number that you can see in front of you. But yeah, so the Shiba Inu game is going to most likely be the biggest game in crypto in an almost instant, I think, because they have a crazy dedicated community and a very large community, but read a little bit into it. So during the recently held spaces over on Twitter, the Sheep army heard the correct info from the Sheep leadership team comprising of beta testers and a couple of people. And apparently this game is going to look a lot like uh, some sort of collectible card game like Hearthstone, Yu-Gi-Oh! and Magic the Gathering. And in my opinion, it's going to be very interesting to see how this is going to play out. Again, they have a huge community, bigger than any other crypto game out there. And so I'm thinking the moment that they launch this game, if they do their marketing right, this could be the number one most downloaded crypto game in existence at this point. So yeah, together with the fact that the more people that use it, you know, the more revenue that the company makes, the more that gets burned, 
I think the Shiba Inu army is going to go absolutely wild on promoting this. Honestly, I'd expected the crypto price, right, for Shiba Inu to pump a lot more because of these announcements. Then again, I can also take it in from this way. It's been speculated that this was going to launch within 12 months from the announcement date. Why? Well, because he posted that it's going to be maximum 12 months. So it would most likely just be a negative thing if it didn't launch within 12 months. It's not that much of a bullish incentive because, well, if everybody expected it to happen anyway, then where can you go? It could also be that it was actually kind of hinted on, let's say, a week ago or so, and the price moved up in that direction until now. Uh, but I'm, I'm looking and thinking, no, right now, as of this point, Shiba Inu is just following along with Bitcoin. Because in the meantime, a couple of nice things have happened, you know. Revolut, for example, has added Shiba Inu and Dogecoin for U.S. customers to uh, utilize on their card as well, which is going to be an interesting one, you know. I, I sometimes wonder how the regulations for this are going to look like in a couple of months or a couple of years, as XRP is having such an interesting battle with the SEC. I wonder what a lot of these other cryptos are going to look like at some point in the future and whether or not everything will be fine. It's just interesting. But I guess it doesn't matter too much. And then one piece that I think was also interesting was, as I said earlier, that Shiba Inu is adding a lot of holders, even though we're in a bear market. And honestly, if you had asked my personal opinion, I would have told you that I don't think that Shiba Inu is one of those coins that can actually ever do well again. After the big bull run, I, I really honestly did not expect Shiba Inu to be one of those projects that would still have some sort of bigger future or so. I really didn't expect it. But right now, looking at it, well, they have the game coming up, they have the big burn out there, and they potentially will have the biggest metaverse in crypto as of some point in the future as well. Yeah, there's a lot of nice incentives to actually be a Shiba Inu holder in comparison to a lot of other cryptos, which are stale. You know, it's not like Luna Classic, which has literally nothing going for themselves anymore except for a burn. You know, that's just hopium to the max. Then again, there's another way off, because if you're asking me, will Shiba Inu go towards that one cent level that people were hoping for, or even a dollar, whatever? Well, the higher it gets in terms of market cap, you know, and uh, theoretically speaking, the less likely these things look. What I mean with that is the higher in the ranking it comes, the less likely it becomes for a 1000x, for example. And when it's very, very far out, let's say it's placed number 70, okay, it's not even possible. What am I saying, dumbass? let's say 700, 9,000, pick a number, right? Very, very far from the top of the top. It's a lot easier to say, well, it could just do a thousand X and we'll all be rich. Yeah, it will go to one cent, let's go, because it's very far out of reach, whatever. But the moment you get to a significant amount of market cap, like 20 billion here, and you've got yourself, you know, still a 100 X to go, for example, things get a lot more difficult to, for a lot of people's brains to, to fathom how significant that change would be and how much money would need to be added here, or how much the value would change. And how the balance would shift as well. From that perspective, if you're asking me, can it go to those prices? I'd say, sure, it can. But there's no real incentive for it to happen as soon. Even if it becomes the biggest game in the entire world, that would not justify the price gain that would come with one cent per Shiba Inu, if you ask me. Uh, could it happen over a longer period of time? Well, there's also the big burn, right? Maybe this burn is going to, at some point, get so significant that, well, the supply is going to be such a fraction of what it is right now. And the reason I'm saying maybe is because if the company makes 5% or gives 5% of the profit every single time, the big game becomes the biggest. It's going to be a lot of profit. It's not going to be that much of a burn straight away, but maybe to think of more incentives. And maybe eventually the supply is going to be cut down so ridiculously much that one cent is not as much as it is right now. Or, of course, they really become the biggest uh, in metaverse, biggest in gaming, and it's going to propel to the number three position in the crypto rankings because all of a sudden that's what people prioritize. Never say never. Would I pick Shiba Inu as my top contender for risk to reward crypto? Uh, no, I don't think it's that good, but I do hold it and I'm not selling the crypto because they have a lot of cool stuff going for themselves, like I explained in my previous video. So am I a Shiba Inu bull? I guess so. I guess I'm pretty bullish on the coin and I do think it's smart to hold it. Then again, not financial advice. And again, it's not a fundamental crypt blockchain, I should say, like the others, um, but it has a big community with a couple of good incentives so they can still do well. Let me say it like that. But yeah, that was it for today's video, guys. Hopefully you all enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you press the like button and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys again in another crypto video later today.